Hi there everybody, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week uh, it's just based on uh, shirts that I've been finding, buying, other things like that. Now, it is a great thing to be able to just go and look around shops for solely football shirts. It's tedious and, and long, but um, I've found some absolute corkers when I've been out. Um, this is just summing up and showing you what might be available on my shop as well. Let's get cracking anyway. So, um, in a charity shop the other week I picked up this training top this Everton training top um, I think that it's it's a recent year I'm not too sure out of the year of it but um, yeah I think it's quite a nice shirt and and yeah I think that any Everton fan I'll be happy to get this it's got some nice colours on it and uh, Umbro never really let anyone down with in in the shirts department so yeah that's a, a really nice shirt um, on eBay I bought this uh, Newcastle 2000-2001 away shirt um, I think that this is one of the nicest shirts that Newcastle have released um, This era of shirts with the NCL sponsor on it was some great shirts that they released I mean there were some ones before it that were really nice but this one in particular is a, a really nice shirt that Newcastle released and um, yeah I think that the sponsor on it just looks really nice and and Adidas can never really put a foot wrong with shirts, but um, yeah, this is these are this is a really nice shirt. I'm quite happy to pick, pick it up, really. Um, but yeah, went to a kilo sale in Rotherham. Um, now, this was just a few of the shirts that I found. I've um, found this England shirt. I've also already got one listed online for a smaller size, but this is a two XL. Um, it's definitely not going to fit me, but <laughs> it's. It's a really nice looking shirt, a training shirt from a few years ago. Not sure what year it was, but it was Umbro. So it must be around maybe 2010, 12. Not sure, but it is, it's a nice shirt. Um, I've got this Barcelona 2008, 2010 away shirt. It's a child size, a medium, <laughs> it says, but um, it's a legit shirt. I checked it out and, and um, yeah, it was a, I loved this shirt when I was, playing on FIFA and I think that this is a great shirt so you'll be happy if you were buying it for your kid or something like that but um, this will be listed up on my store it's a Liverpool polo shirt it's a standard chartered era of Liverpool so around Roy Hodgson maybe when that Jovanovic, Joe Cole, uh, Paul Konchesky era of mad Liverpool signings but I think it's a really smart polo shirt and anybody would be buzzing to buy this I've got the uh, this Chelsea t-shirt, I think the colours are definitely not me or the team to be honest but it's got the nice Champions League badge there and, and the, the, the badge is the same colour as the three stripes. And I think it would be any Chelsea fans out there have got the joggers as well listed at the moment as the video is being recorded anyway so you might want to get the double, <laughs> that'll be listed at a reasonable price. I found this at Nottingham Forest 2018 to 2019, I think. It's a 3XL, but I can't imagine that a 3XL would fit in this. It's just quite a small fit into it. It'd probably fit a large or an extra large anyway. It's a really nice looking shirt and, and it looks in pretty much brand new condition. So any Forest fans out there, there you go. I found this. Sheffield Wednesday jumper. It, I was going to keep it to be honest, but it's a very nice jumper. Uh, it doesn't fit me though. It's an extra large and yeah, it'll be listed shortly. <laughs> got a large Manchester United jacket. It's got the DHL sponsor on it as well. So I, I can only imagine it's recent. I'm not sure as to when it was. But it has got some really good detailing on the back with the, the name of the club. And also um, there's no marks on it and absolutely nothing wrong with it. But it's in great condition. And it's a nice track jacket. Got this Ajax 2014-2015 polo shirt. At the Kilo sale, obviously, if anybody's been, it's crazy. People just... I like vultures, they'll just dive on anything that's new. And this woman brought down like about 
six, seven t-shirts, this being one of them, I was stood waiting um, and someone nearly took my head off going for it, but I got it just in time. But I was so happy when it come down, I could see it and I just knew that it's, it's, it's such a nice looking polo shirt. It doesn't suit me, which I was a bit gutted, but that'll be listed on my Depop. I've got this weird looking Sunderland thing. It's got like thermals down the arms and then you've got this sort of like jumper thing that stops on the arms. It, I would never wear it myself, but I'm sure some Sunderland fans might like it. The collar's there, it's small, so anybody that's interested, just go and have a look on my Depop. Got this Liverpool shirt from 2013 to 2014, um, the year that Gerard slipped, if I'm not wrong. Um, Warrior shirts, they're pretty rubbish, but um, this was found at a kilo sale as well. It's in great condition. There's nothing wrong with it. It's a medium. It's got like a little imprint of the badges throughout. Yeah. And then we've got the Man United 2014-2015 home shirt. When Shre Chevrolet first started to be the sponsor, it's just in your face, as you can see. Uh, it's got the Premier League badges on it. On the sides. It's a legit shirt. It's not fake or anything and it seems in pretty great condition a really nice shirt so that's the video for this week uh there is some great shirts that i have found it is good to have a look around at shirts that i wouldn't have usually bought obviously being a city fan it is nice to have a look for other things as well but it is really good when you find something that is a good value all of these will be listed on depop for a really good price as well so if you do want to have a look it's just in the link below all my Twitter and Facebook and also Instagram feeds are also linked below. If you just follow me on all of those, it'd be great. Thanks very much and I'll see you next week.